Hello, Leo, and welcome to your weekly reading. Leo, this is for the week of January 2nd through the 8th, 2022, so Happy New Year to you all. I hope you all are doing well and that the new year so far has been very good to you. Welcome to my channel. If you're new here, Force for the Trees, I appreciate you all being here. Um, if you're returning, thank you so much for your trust and support, for your likes, shares, and subscribes, for all the comments you all leave and, and questions and everything. So I appreciate you guys. Um, anything you need, Leo's listed below. If you would like a personal reading with me, if you would like to um, know the decks of cards I use, or... If you'd like to know more about astrology, I have it all listed. Interesting, Page of Pentacles, and we also have the Page of Wands. This is uh, a new venture starting off. This is a new idea coming in. This could be a new um, way that you're thinking of making money. Or you could, um, you know, a new path that you're going on, a new direction you're going on with your job, or a new job for you. It's some type of new... Um, idea of how to make money or a new business opportunity coming in to make money um again with the spark the spark of creation spark of ideas the spark of um what you desire and what you want to pursue and maybe thinking oh i wonder if that can make money for me i think the answer is yes um again having that uh you have a novice approach to something, but, but, you know, everybody at one point in time is there and you only get to where you're a CEO of a company by starting, by starting, right? So it can take a while, but there's growth here. You have an indecision. You are, um, It's like the, the, the path you want to go on, you're just undecided about. Um, you need to talk to friends. You need to talk to family. But you really, really need to listen to your yourself. Listen to in, your intuition. Really feel which direction you need to go into the, you know, first and foremost. Um It's something you have to face. Two is a card of balance, bringing balance into your communication or your ideas. Um, it's a card you have to face. You have to face something. Uh, it could be making a decision. You have to maybe make a decision. It could be the job you're at now or a new endeavor. You could be leaving something um, to start something you're passionate about. Maybe you're going to take a cut and pay, but it will be worth it in the long run. Weighing the pros and cons, you know, coming up with an idea, coming up with decisions. Um, but know that you have the power, you have the strength, you have the fortitude to get through this. You have, the, you have what it takes to do this. You have what it takes to get you through this, even, even on a novice level. And I think that's what you're, you're feeling is that... You know, weighing the pros and cons of everything is what I think you're doing. But you have to be open and honest with yourself, too. And something you might have to consider, you might have to work both jobs for a while. You might have to do two of some things for a while. In order to make ends meet. Card on the page of wands, please. I always had three cards. Goodness gracious. Page of wands for Leo. And you know, Leo, uh, the strength, strength card is your card. So you are showing up in your own reading fortifying whatever decision you make you need to know that you have the strength to do it the page of wands is the moon so you know again it's talking about follow your dreams you know the path will be illuminated you have to take the step what is it um jump in the net will appear you have to have that faith you have to take that that first step you have to 
uh, believe that the path will be illuminated. You have to believe that uh, things will be shown to you once you start on your journey, but you have to start. You have to make your mind up and move forward. And again, know you'll have the strength. You'll have the strength to to move forward and the strength to do um, whatever it is you have to do. Pull a card on the Two of Swords, please. You could have one um, that just popped right out. Wheel of Fortune. Again, anything you want to do, you can do. You have a shift in energy that's on your side right now. You have a shift in energy. It's almost like a portal's open and you have this window of opportunity to um, to uh, act upon. And the Wheel of Fortune is telling you to don't, um, don't wait too long because it won't be there for long. It will turn. So right now you're on a high and you're, it's open and you can go do this jump on it take you know don't think about this too long don't overthink something move forward on it move forward on it it's something you've dreamt about it's something you want to manifest it's something it could be some type of schooling or some type of growth or some type of movement forward that you are uh, wanting to do that it's something you desire something that you're you're you've been wanting to do so again jump jump on this opportunity that's been given to you because it won't, um, it won't be there for a long, you know, for a long time. It won't be there for forever. And I, I feel with the Wheel of Fortune too, um, it's been a long time coming. This is something that you could have had on a back burner for a long, long time thinking about what if I do this or what if I go here or what if I do this? And you're going to have, you know, now you have the moon card. The moon card is um, today, um, if you're watching this on Sunday, January 2nd, it is a um, new moon in Capricorn. And then we have an, a full moon on the 17th in Cancer. So that could have something to do with the moon card. There could be some significance by then. Maybe you'll get an answer by then. All right. Very interesting. Let's pull one more card for you. Thoughts, decisions. It's just asking you to really sit down and have a heart to heart with yourself. Have a gut, you know, listen to your gut instinct, but also not to overthink it. Um, it's like ask yourself, you know, do I want to do this? And what's the first thought that comes to your mind? And take it. Don't go, well, I said yes. And then I thought no. And then possibly, and you know, think of all the situations that come up with this. You know, look at, you have adventures. So both of these cards are new. You know, starting off on new somethings, new adventures, right? And if you don't, try you'll never know if you don't try you'll never know and look at the beauty you might miss if you don't if you don't try no those are leaves i thought those were fish i'm like there's fish and birds okay Something exciting is around the corner. You are entering a new frontier filled with expansive energy. Begin to look at your world in a new and different way. Something that you thought was mundane or someone who you may have overlooked will open the door to new opportunities and a bigger and bolder way of living. Be willing to see the world around you in new ways. Don't be lulled into complacency. This card appears when you're ready to remove your blinders and take action. Ready to remove your blinders. She's blindfolded. And take action so life doesn't become stagnant and lackluster. It's also, it also can signify incredible spiritual attunement and spiritual voyages. Beautiful. I just feel like there's things you can do that you never thought you could do. And there's a whole world out there waiting for you to figure this out. All right, Leo. 
Good luck to you. What a beautiful week. Take care of yourself and each other and stay safe and healthy. Until next week, Leo. Good luck to you. Bye for now.